Hello there, Ben Bowers, the Spirit Specialist, and I am here today to talk to you about Katokin Creek Roundstone Rye 80 proof. Now, normally I would be holding up a bottle at this point so you can see what it looks like, but unfortunately I have sold out and I'm waiting for a new order to come in. So here is a picture of the bottle as what it looks like. Um, now this is from the Katokin Creek Distillery uh, in a place called Purcellville, uh, Virginia. It's about an hour's drive away from Washington DC. Uh, it was opened in 2009. It was the first distillery in uh, Loudoun County, the county where it's based, uh, since Prohibition. Uh, and it was set up by the husband and wife team, Becky and Scott Harris. Now, um, there might be some people looking at that going, oh, well, obviously Scott is the distiller, but no, it's not the case. Becky is actually the master distiller. Um, she has a uh, career in chemical engineering um, and is using those skills to produce some fantastic whiskies. Um, so they are um, what you would consider a stereotypical craft whiskey distillery, but they are producing some absolutely fantastic spirits. They also do a brandy, uh, a gin, uh, wine as well. Uh, they are certified organic and kosher, so they are proper hipster, you could probably call them, but that would be very, very unfair. So what I have here is the Katokin Creek Roundstone Right 80 proof, uh, which is their entry level. Now this is uh, about two years old. It's quite a young whiskey. Uh, they mature it in charred white oak, American oak virgin casks. Um, and so we are looking at something relatively young. Now at the time of recording, um, it's uh, 37.99. Um, prices may change depending on what, when you're watching this. Um, but uh, I do think this is a pretty good value for money whiskey uh, straight off the bat. Need to point out at this point that this is 80 proof. It's not 80% ABV. ABV is alcohol by volume. So if something was 50% ABV, alcohol by volume, that means that whatever the volume is, be it a small glass or a bottle or a magnum or whatever, if it's 50% ABV, half of that is pure alcohol. Proof is different, and confusingly, there are two types of proof. US proof is quite easy to work out. US proof is double the ABV. UK proof, Different story altogether, I'm not gonna go into it now. So the Roundstone Rye 80 proof is actually just 40% ABV. It is not 80% alcohol. This is not gonna knock your socks off. So yes, we are looking at the 40% uh, version of the Roundstone Rye. Just wanted to point that out before things get confusing. On the nose, there's a lovely kind of toasted rye bread element. Sometimes rye whiskies can go really either sour, like sour sourdough, or almost petrally, and this has a little bit of sharpness to it, but it's actually really well balanced. There is a nice toastiness to it. There's an orange peel element in there as well. Almost even a hint of mint. On the palate, yes, it's youthful. There is a spiciness to it, but there's also an underlying butteriness. It's almost as though that toasted brown bread, the toasted rye bread, has a layer of butter over the top of it. That little hint of orange does come through. It almost turns into a little bit of like fruit toast. It's quite fresh though. It's, you know, it's still young, it's still got a sharpness. So this would work really well in cocktails as well as just drinking on its own. So if you're having old fashions or any bourbon based cocktail, this has enough of a bite to it that you're gonna be able to taste it through other mixers and other ingredients. But it's not so sharp and so powerful that you can't drink it on its own. Now, this is, quite slightly chilled because I'm filming this in January of 2021. So uh, this is when it's been officially released. Katokin Creek literally this week have released it in the UK. However, I have been selling this since November and it's been selling really, really well. So 37.99 for this I think is a very, very good price indeed. If you're looking for something rich and mellow, this probably isn't for you. But if you're wanting something with a little bit of zip, a bit of character, a bit of interest, something that's gonna kind of like give you something to work with and also, like I say, work with cocktails, I think this is really, really good. It's eminently drinkable. I think, I think for the price, you get equivalent bourbons that are just kind of too rough and ready. Whereas this has character, it has youthfulness, it has zip, it has energy, it has vibrance. I really, really like this and I think it is really good for the price. So uh, once I've got stock back in, uh, because at the time of recording, I'm fortunately I'm waiting for an order to turn up, but this will be available through the website, www.spiritspecialist.com. Um, and I do recommend it and uh, keep an eye out for the other two videos for the rest of the range when we look at the uh, Distillers Edition 82 proof and the Cash proof as well. So I shall see you at the next one. Cheers.